May your expedition meet with every success. Thank you. Thank you, Father Rosai. You must be proud that your son has been chosen to guide Captain Fremont into the great Northwest. I am proud, Padre. I need hardly ask that you ever respect the motto of your family. Faithfulness with bravery. Faithfulness with bravery. There's Captain Fremont and the troops now. Robert. The troop is waiting, and if you're ready, we'll start. My blessings on thee, my son. Captain? Why, oh, certainly. Go ahead. See? I told you not to buy that horse in the first place. Trouble. I know it won't give me no more trouble. Much obliged, but I'd rather walk. Well, what do you say we trade? Saddle and all. It's a good idea. It's a perfect idea. It's a trade. Goodbye, Senor Loring. Goodbye, Captain. Take good care of Don. My gratitude for your assistance and hospitality. Bye. Too many disappear, somebody will get wind of what we're doing. You have no right to this gold. It's our land that belongs to Senor Loring. Darn. What do I care whose property it is? Gold is a means to an end. I had use for it. When you first brought us here, this country was a land of peace. Now look what you've done to it. Murder and slavery. When my father and I are no better than prisoners. You are prisoners, Miss Colton. And you'll remain so just as long as I need your father's mining experience. Get out there and see what's up, Talbot. Yes. Yes, of 
message to my government stated that you had a matter of great importance to discuss. Yes. We both know that certain countries would like to own California. Am I right? Go on. Your country and the United States, for instance. Yet, California is a province of Mexico. Just how does all this affect my government? With the backing of Imperial Russia, I can build myself a colonial empire west of the Rocky Mountains. What do you personally expect to gain? Supreme dictatorship. I fully realize that California is a rich territory. But under no circumstances would my country consider laying claim to it. And why not? Because annexation would lead to war both the United States and Mexico. Yes, from a land rich with gold. Gold in California. Then why doesn't the United States government do something about it? For the simple reason that outside of me and my men, and now yourself, no one knows the secret. Very interesting, General. There's one obstacle. Fremont and his American troops. I control Ortega Pass, and Come over here at the map and I'll show you. I want to show you, Count Rathbunov, we have nothing to worry about. Now, Tago Pass here is the only way into Sonoma Valley from the north. Fremont is over here in Oregon Territory mapping out train. He won't be back this way. the Columbia River. Your government now has a route to the great Northwest. Come on, Eddie! Huh? Fall out! I'll make camp here. Watch that center pimp and I'll show you something. Let me show you how to do it. You missed it too. Well, I'll be all gone. <laughs> well, I might have known it was you, Don. <laughs> I see you're still keeping up with the old boy. It's a long trip. I hate to lose you. Do you really have to go back? Well... I'm afraid so, Captain. California's in my blood. It's quiet there and peaceful. You know, there's a little mission near my father's hacienda, where the bells ring softly and... Thank 
Kramer. Now put him to work. Come on, get inside that. Vanishing with regular Russian troops is out of the question. It's entirely up to you, Count Ratanov. I stand ready to deliver Imperial Russia a very wealthy colony. However, uh, pending the approval of my government, I can furnish you with ex soldiers in the Russian colony at Fort Bruce. How about guns and ammunition? Oh, I can arrange that also, provided uh, I profit by the deal. I can see that we understand each other perfectly. The on raids are increasing. No man's life is safe. You are right, Signor Lori. But we must have patience. At least until we know who is responsible. Patience is all right, Padre Mio. But I intend to protect my land against intruders. Come on, son. Adam for the South Range, Dark Feather. We'll look for the other. Si, senor. What are you doing on my property, Senor Burr? I was just uh, looking over the land with the idea of making you an offer. You know that not an acre of my rancho is for sale. I'll be pleased if you stay away. How are you feel that way about it, Senor Loring? Send for my brother. Done. They shall not rest, Padre Leo, until their deaths have been avenged. Think not of vengeance, my son. All the forces of evil seem to be at work in our land. No one knows who is responsible. 
so you must be very careful to hide your identity. I understand, good father. Dark Feather has told me everything. But I intend to fight fire with fire. If I don't know them, they at least will not know me. But when I strike, it will be with the swiftness of an eagle. interfering with my plan. Now, I've offered a reward for the death of the eagle. You've got to get rid of it. I've tried, but I can't get a line on it. You don't know what else to do. Do? We have got to trap it. Get rid of it. Do anything. Hey, here's something you haven't tried. Now listen. Search the place good. He must be in here someplace. Where'd you get that organ player? From Monterey, senor. He's a great musician. Nobody that plays an organ's any good. Eagle ain't in the mission. Come on. I believe you know more about this than you told.
friend to you? Who has done this to you? Senor Bursnip. That's a beautiful ring you have there, senor. Jason Byrne. Who is Jason Byrne? The most powerful man in California. You should be glad he wants to see you. Why? Why? Because he wants to make a deal with you. Very well. I'm ready to go. But I wouldn't try any funny business if I were you. Don't worry. I'm not that foolish. That's him, all right. Come on, fellas. It's the eagle. Going back to the fort. Your father's murder has been took care of. Ain't you satisfied? No. There's more behind this than we thought. I'll never stop till I get the man behind all this. Now, tie me on the back of this mule. I'm just a simple musician. I uh... lock him up till I have more time to question. Take him off. Petro! Did you bring that ammunition you tell Rathman off promise? Had their Cossacks unload the wagon. What are you doing in here? I'm not going to harm you. 
I know you won't. Thank you, Senorita. Oh, you mustn't go downstairs. They'll kill you. Not if I can help it. Stand still, Bert. First move will be your last. sent word that I'd be here. What's your proposition? Well, I... He was a smart man like you. Yes, yes, that's what Barson said. Barson was a fool. He got only what was coming to him. If you join up with me, I'll make you one of the richest men in California. I have unlimited gold, the backing of one of the greatest countries in the world. You've already sent me ammunition and classics. Nothing can stop my conquest of California. Does your campaign include the whipping of innocent priests? Well, if you oppose my plans, yes. Then here's my answer. Take off your coat. I said take off your coat. Hit me with that whip and I'll make you regret it the longest day you live. Thank you. 
He's gone inside. Quarter him. anymore. You can send your men back to their post. Well, they did. that foreigner. Huh. All ready for you, Count. I brought good news, provided you've done your part. And to think that the one man who could have saved us is dead. Thank you for your interest, Senorita, but I wouldn't want to disappoint Senor Burr. Please, be careful. And when will you make payment for the arms and ammunition I brought you from Fort Bruce? Where is the ammunition? Safely stored at Santa Rosalie. And there it will remain until you've carried out your part of the bargain. Howard, go to the mine and bring back the gold set aside for Count Raspinall. Yes, sir. Pardon, General Burr. You wish to question the prisoner? Oh, turn him loose. I thought he might lead me to the Eagle. But now that the Eagle is dead, there is nothing can prevent me from becoming supreme dictator of all California. Yes. With the aid of Imperial Russia. And under her flag. Right. I mean I can go now? Gracias, senor. Gracias. <laughs> Best thing for you to do, young fellas, to stick to the organ plant.
right, take it in the general bar. imperialism. The Eagle. Then this ends our agreement. The Eagle revealed our secret negotiations. It will mean more with Mexico or even the United States. I will not jeopardize my government. But you let me have the ammunition stored to Santa Rosalie. What for? Without soldiers, guns have no value. I'll get soldiers. I'll conscript an army. I'll draft every man in Sonoma Valley. Head off! Assemble your men. Ride to every town, ranch, and hacienda. For you, Padre Mio. Give it to the poor. What's happened? Jason Burr raising an army. Hey, cracky. Rebellion. Then we'll take justice into our own hands. Organize the ranchers into a vigilance committee. Oh, but what can a few men do against an entire army? We can strike before they organize. Burr is depending on ammunition stored at Santa Rosalie. Come on, boys. Ride to every hacienda in the valley. We're going to fight fire with fire. Tell the ranchers to meet me at Coldwater Canyon. <laughs> Sonoma Valley, for many years we have lived here in peace. Now our homes, our liberty, 
Even our lives are being threatened. We must organize against invasion by a foreign power and restore peace to California. Do you approve? We do! Yes. Even now, arms and ammunition are being stored at Santa Rosalie. Our first move is to raid the warehouse. At 12 o'clock, we strike. I told you not to come here. Someone might see you. But I had to, General. He keeps stirring up the ranchers. He's forming a vigilance committee. Vigilantes? What do I care about vigilantes? I'm forming a new army. But you must listen. They're going to raid Santa Rosalie at 12 o'clock. They're after your ammunition. Well, why didn't you say so in the first place? That wrong. Somebody across that right to Santa Rosalie. I want the eagle dead or alive. Let me stop. The rest of them are. They're hid back here somewhere. Hmm. It ain't gonna be no picnic. Who do you suppose they are? Oh, just a couple of old crows. Keep the men under cover. It isn't 12 o'clock yet. Я не понимаю, что нужно. Товарищ Саньон, я не понимаю, что нужно. Убирайся отсюда вон. Аллилуйя, Панчей. Пошел вон, я не понимаю. Hey, you understand English? Я ничего не понимаю, но убирайся отсюда вон. Ай, я вам
get here sooner, but the Russians cut me off. Who might you be? He's all right. He's clever figures. I know him. Well, let's keep an eye out for the eagle. There he is. Let's go. Mount up, boys. Let's get to a meeting place. Looks like a mighty good place to hide. Them Russians never would find us here. But so you get out and keep an eye on that open country, will you? Good idea. Now, men, we're in a dangerous situation. Jason Burr has formed an army, and we've got to stick together from now on. Now, I've prepared an oath of allegiance. Are you ready to sign it? In fairness to all, do you mind telling us just who you are? Ain't it enough to know he's fighting for your land and freedom? Salvation's right. Now, we do solemnly swear loyalty to the Vigilance Committee of Sonoma Valley to do our utmost to protect California from Imperial Russia, and in its support we pledge our lives, our fortunes, and our sacred honor. The Cossacks are coming. I'll lead them away. After they're gone, you get the rest of the signatures. Somebody go by here on a horse riding like the devil was after him? The devil? It's very quiet here. Search the place. Salvation got the vigilantes signed up. All finished. Come on, men.
What are you doing, playing squat tag? No. I must have run into something. Hey. Take a look at my head, will you? Why? Oh! Hey, that's as pretty a goose egg as I've ever seen. What's pretty about it? Look. What? It's gone. What? The oath. We gotta find the eagle. That means there's a traitor in the vigilantes. We must get up to Burr's fort and find out who he is. Why, we could go up there and tear that fort clean apart. Yeah. No, it would mean bloodshed. And Burr would still have the names of all the vigilantes. I got an idea. I can get some walnut juice and an old hat and some knickknacks. I believe I can walk right into Jason Burr's stronghold. Find out who that reptile is. That's a good idea. Now, this is how I'll do it. Looks like a Mexican peddler. You want to let him in? We'll see what he's got to sell first. But General Burr said to not let anybody in. What he don't know won't hurt him. He's busy down to mine. He won't be back for an hour. We ought to be able to buy a little junk for him. Guard, open the gate. Senors, I have beautiful shawls for the ladies, fried chicken, pants, skirts, hats, beads, cactus candy. All right, all right, all right. Go on in. Gracias, senor. Bring the beautiful things, senor. Look what he gave us. <laughs> Senorita, you buy the beautiful Sorati home? Not today, thank you. There's a spy among the vigilantes. Do you know who it is? No, but I'll try to find out. Oh, I have the beautiful gift for you, senorita. They are pets. I give them to you. And when you're tired of them, they make delicious pigeon pie. If you do find out, they'll fly straight to the eagle. No, senorita. I tell you, I've got to see General Burr. Hold your horses. I told you he'd be here in a minute. Senor, you want to buy? See, Senor, it is very beautiful. You'd better buy. Because I've got a gun pointing right at your wishbone. General Burr's coming. Get that peddler out of here. See, si, senor, I'd be very glad to take you back to town. Get in that seat and keep your mouth shut. Yes, he stole this paper from me. It's a list of the vigilantes. 
Time up! Vigilantes have signed their own death warrant. And as a lesson to all others, this peddler will be executed in the public square of Santa Rosalie. By now, he's been gone a long time. Have patience, my son. Now, nothing's going to happen to that old alligator. He's got out of more scrapes than he ever here tell on.
was the eight. That's for you to find out. Salvation, you spoiled my aim. And his and two. It's a vigilante. Get ready to play. Now, let them have a few rounds. 
Gentlemen, now I'd like to know when to close in. Come on in. It's all right, Doris.
Doris, a pretty thick brush. Maybe it's in there. You'd better stay here with the vigilante, Doris. Somebody here. That gang thing had stopped hammering. Maybe I could hear something. I'll tell you what you do, Salvation. Cut up some blasting powder. We're going to close this mine for good. Look! It's cold. What happened, Colton? They were careful. They know you're here. Take him to the vigilantes and make tracks to the hideout. Our gang will get the silly beer and go find some blasting powder.
somebody here. I'll tell you what you do, Salvation. Cut up some blasting powder. We're going to close this mine for good. Look! It's cold. What happened, Colton? They were careful. They know you're here. Take him to the vigilantes and make tracks to the hideout. I'll join you just as soon as me and the Eagle can find some blasting powder and blow this place up. That's a good idea. conquering California. This will take care of things here. It's Petrov and the Cossacks. Get everybody under cover until I can lead them away. Then blow up the mine after I'm gone. Then meet me at the mission. Everything's all right, Padre Mule. We've captured the mine. I can send your people back to their homes. I won't need you miners anymore. Oh, what are you going to do with me? You'll find out. Fix them up and join the Eagle at the mission. The 
vigilante. And the eagle's with him. He's wounded. going to that girl and the old man. Answer me. Albert, taking the girl and her father to the fort. Take off them clothes, Lucian. Hurry up. What you aiming to do, Whitsaw? Well, if it looked like a Russian, I'm going into that fort and get Miss Colt. What about the whiskers? Take your knife and shave them off of it. I'll use them. Well, salvation, how do I look? Great. I don't know if you look that good. I'd have done it myself. Guess I'll be getting over to the fort. I don't believe you understand me. Sure I do. Eagle, where'd you get this? It's the mine. Untie me. I must go to General Burke. Where did your father get the eagle's coat? Well, the vigilantes have blown up your mind.
No, oh, they won't stand for a dictator, huh? Well, I'll show them who's running California, mine or no mine. Get Peters here at once. Assemble your Cossack. Stand by for orders. I'll learn you to come snooping around here. <coughs> Don't you know me? I'm Whipsaw. Well, I'll be doggone. Well, I wasn't doing you either, Whipsaw. But what's up? Burr's laying a trap for the vigilante. He's got Peters dressed up like the eagle, and he's going to pull a fast one unless we can stop him. the vigilantes by here. Salvation circle around to warn the vigilantes. Trick! 
the other one is the eagle. There he goes. After him. him into ambush. I'll cut across and beat him to the Cossacks. You and Salvation circle around and warn the vigilantes. You, Peters. The eagle's after me. Eagle coming. Fire the minute you see him.
like we're stuck. They have to hold in here for a spell. Well, we're safe enough as long as our supplies hold out. How's the ammunition? Not too much. If we're in for a siege. I've got it. Let's all you and Salvation get two or three ropes and tie them together. That's a good idea. That's the only one you'd catch? Yes, sir. I'm going to the fort to report to General Burr. When the other men come in, tell them to watch this trail until I get back. Right, sir. shipment of arms and ammunition. And there's nothing can stop me from becoming dictator of all California. I'll have it unloaded at once. Is the payment ready? General Burr is always ready for every emergency. But there'll be a slight delay, an unfortunate mishap. The Eagle has raided my gold mine, and it's closed temporarily. I'm glad to report, however, that we have succeeded in ambushing the vigilantes, and the ambush failed. But we have the vigilantes trapped in their hideout and it's only a matter of time until we succeed in starving them into submission. But why delay? Russia would simply blast them out of that position, have done with the whole thing. You have the artillery, and I've brought you ammunition. That's exactly what I'll do. Come on, Petrov. Hey, get out that field piece. We're going to blow the vigilantes off the face of the earth. Come on, hurry. Come on, man, roll out that field piece. Burr is sending a cannon and a wagon load of ammunition to attack the vigilantes. If you could warn the eagle. I can. That's why he left me the pigeons.
much ammunition shall we take along? All of it. I want you to stay at the hideout. The last vigilante is dead. You're the one that's been informing the Eagle of my plans, huh? What do you mean? Oh, you don't know what I mean, do you? Everybody all right? It's all right, but it's a little stuffy. Probably anxious to surrender, and ain't nobody drawn a bead on him yet. Don't you? <laughs> you know, that message was meant for us, all right, but I can't understand why Dora sent it. Maybe Burr wrote it. Oh, no, it was in her handwriting. Hey, there comes another wagon over the hill. 
Maybe we just hit the wrong wagon. That must be the one. You line over while I draw off the Cossacks and we can capture the whole works. That's a good idea.
Captain, the wagon. Well, I give it another shot. So you get up behind him and go to the mission. I'll do my own ride. I ain't no baby. No, it's better this way. I'll take Whipsaw's horse and deliver the ammunition to the hideout, and I'll join you later. Now get going. You're the eagle's horse. I think you'll come in handy. Bring him along. Salvation, old man. I didn't know they had you stretched out. How do you feel? Where will I get up? I'll show Jason Byrne his coast axe who's dictator of California. How about the vigilantes? Can they hold out? They have enough ammunition now to hold that place till Fremont gets here. If they have to.
You men, get among those rocks. The rest of you, get along the trail. I want to cover this spot from every angle. Wheel that gun around. Place between those two rocks. It's his horse, all right. and he needs help. Come on, boys. until you get him trapped amongst those boulders, and then close in. Don't fire unless you have to. I want them alive. Stop your weapon. Keep your hands away from your gun. General, your ambition to rule California as a Russian colony will never be realized. What about the Eagle? We didn't get him, but we used his horse to trap his men. And we'll use his men to trap the Eagle. Bird's going to trick the Eagle. We must warn him. What can you do? He took your pigeons. I'll get them. Plenty of eagle a message. Come on in, Miss Golden. Perhaps you'd be interested in hearing what it says. I told him that I would turn his vigilante friends loose if he would come here and surrender. That's fair enough trade, is it? If he's as brave as you think he is, I'm quite sure he'll take me up. Jason Burr won't release them, even if you do appear. Well, that remains to be seen. I'm not 
going in those clothes? Yes, just as I am. What will I wear? You're not going. message for your commander. Well, what is it? I, I have to give it to him personally. Get your rifle. For General Burr. He's busy. Well, it's from the Eagle. Well, that's different. Come on inside. In my opinion, a shrewd man like the Eagle will not come here. I'm counting on the man's peculiar code of honor. Excuse me, General, but this organ player says he has a message from the Eagle. Oh, he has, huh? Well, come on, up with it. Well, of course, I don't know what he means, but he said that he'd be in the stockade five minutes after I arrived. Five minutes after you arrive. Yes, yes. Come on. We'll get ready to receive our visitor. He will be here in five minutes. Post your men on the walls and shoot him down as soon as he enters the gate. Petrov will take care of the vigilante. Smiling, if you know what's good for you. Hey! I've kept my appointment. I released my men. Take it easy. Let's talk this thing over. There's nothing to talk about. Do as I tell you. I've changed my mind, Petrov. Heard old men loose. Do as I tell you. Give them the horses and send them home.
excuse me for rushing in like this, but I... You? The organ player? Yes. Yes, my name is Don Loring. Don Loring? Those men killed your father and brother. Yes. I, uh, I have to wear these things. Yeah, hide in there. Quick. Thanks. They'll find you. Has the eagle been in here? In my room? We've searched every place. Inside and out. The eagle is not in the fort. He's bound to be here somewhere. But I've been to every room. All over the place. He's not here. Get out. Go on. Get out of here. I don't see how you can expect to be dictated of all California when you can't even dictate to one man. What difference does one bandit make to me? I have Monterey, Sacramento, and Los Angeles. All under my control. I have all passes from the south covered. This entire district is mine. All except Sonoma Valley. What other? It's going to be a question of time till I'll wipe out this eagle and his vigilante. Meanwhile, I have lots of gold. Money for you, for me, and the Tsar. Find this treaty making me governor for life? And the Imperial Russian flag will fly before nightfall. Mm. Mm. This is plenty of time. That's where you're wrong. Fremont and his cavalry are back from Oregon most any day. Then treat it will be. All land, mineral rights, property, people pass the personal ownership of the Tsar. The Russian flag will fly, but you will reign as dictator. Back for you as I have it written. Stop it! Prepare a coach for his excellency. Want a better off to furnish an escort. We're starting the treaty on its way to Russia. Right, General. Put these on, Miss Colden. Oh, but they won't fit. I'm sorry, it's the only way you'll get out of this fort. Well, what about you? Well, don't you worry about me. I'll wait outside for you until you're ready. <laughs> Careful, don't let it touch the ground. You're in Russia now, Talbot. Get off! the treaty to Monterey. Yes, that means you'll have to leave at once. I can't do a thing until I know you're safe. But suppose they recognize me. I know it's risky, but you keep your face hidden and no one will notice you. Good luck.
Say, what's that organ player been doing for the last hour? I don't know. Keep an eye on him. Wait a minute, you. Not so fast. bullet went right through here. But I'm so tough it didn't even leave a hole. <laughs> you know, Padre, seems like I'm better than ever was. Good work, you old horse thief. <laughs> well, I ain't strong. Rasmanoff has a treaty and is headed for Monterey. If he ever gets out of the valley, Russian soldiers will overrun California. It's up to me to stop him. You mean it's up to us to stop him? You're supposed to be sick. Yeah, but if I stayed here, who'd take care of you? Well, I'm glad you're here, Doris. Put so, salvation. Come on. We're going after Rasmanoff. across the road, maybe we can make them take the Ford. That's a good idea. Huh. Wouldn't surprise me, none if you can lift that for yourself. You always claim to be so strong. Well, I'd like to see you try and lift it. I don't do nothing my horse can do better. Well, I already did say that horse had more sense than you got. Come on, sit down here. Tree is blocking the road. Shall we move it? No, there's no time for that. Where does that lead? Across the ford. It's quicker, but rough. We'll go that way.
kicked Count Reisenhoff. any longer. We'll go back to the fort and report to General Byrd. Santa Rosalie and your picked men to the mine. What are you going to do now? Look for the treaty first signed with Russia. You'll pay for this outrage. I'm an emissary from the court of his imperial majesty. Tsar of Russia. Oh. Well, maybe you are, maybe you ain't. That ain't going to make the edge of this knife no duller. Where do you want me to start? going to be pretty mad at me for doing this to you, you big Russian. There you are. Take care of him. Look, a 
treaty signed by Burbank in California, a Russian colony. That means that Burr has won. Not if I can get this treaty to Fremont. Oh, but how can you? Jason Burr controls every pass from the valley. I know one place that ain't tightened up yet. Ortego Pass. There's only a couple of Russians there. How do you know? I got it out of Raspinall. Then that's our route to Fremont. Come on. on the left and keep them on the cover. That's today. Where are you men along the ridge? Spread out and cover heavy into that hill. There's no telling where the eagle might try to get through. Put your horses back there and deploy to the right. Hurry it up. You may be here any time. Here. Let's try the old Indian trick, Whipsaw. That's a good idea. Thank you. 
Don Fernando, Felipe Santa Maria, Emilio Ventura. Where are you going? Ah, I go to see beauty, my friend. Love, life, and happiness. This is the eagle. Let him go. Nice gun you have there. Oh, my rifle, you take him? Maybe I go long hunt. I need my gun. Here, take my gun. Get along. Adios, senor. So make me up a bow and arrow. I'll be right back.
better get out of here. Look after him, Whipsaw. See if there's anything he wants. How long do you aim to hold him here? Until Fremont gets here and raises the flag of the United States over Sonoma Valley. That's a good idea! Well, it's our only way to keep Jason Burr from becoming dictator of California and turning it into a Russian colony. Without Raspinoff, he can't get aid from the Tsar's troops. Thank you, my child. You know, I think it would be a kind deed if you took some to Count Raspinoff. I intend to, Padre. treaty with Russia is on its way to Captain Fremont. Salvation got through the Cossack outpost at Ortega Pass. We should reach the American troops by tomorrow. Then we've seen the last of Jason Burr and his Cossacks. <laughs> They must find you here. like a highwayman. Like there's nothing here worth stealing. How about you? Have you seen the eagle? 
How could I, senor? Uh, this is the hour for my music lesson. Search the place. Don't stand there like dummies. But if he wears a mask, how will you know him? He's wounded. If I find a man with blood on him, I know I have the right one. with you. Nervous? No, uh, I'm just a little faint. The Eagle is not in the mission, Commander. If you ever do see the Eagle, let me know. Si, senor. He never was in no trouble. I had him covered all the time. First of all, I want you to light out of here and round up the vigilantes to meet at the hideout. Ready to join Fremont's troops as soon as he arrives. We're going to fight it out with Berg. The mission bell will be your signal. And as soon as you hear it, come on the run. Son? Senor Padre, I come from Santa Rosalie. El Capitan Fremont, he sent me. Is he there? Si, senor. He sent me to look for the eagle. Well, I'm sorry, but he's not here. El Capitan will be sorry, too. I'll go look elsewhere. Take a look, George. Make sure that he's gone. Troops got here sooner than I expected. I'll go meet them and then notify the vigilantes. Be careful. I will, Doris. can play it. Put him on a horse. We're going to the fort. Senor, senorita, she's in the mission too. Get that girl and bring her along. Right.
So the great eagle's been caged at last. Shall I have him shot at once? Not yet. Perhaps not at all if you'll tell us where he's hidden Count Raspinoff. Where's Raspinoff? I want an answer. Pull out the firing squad. It's what? Shoot him down in cold blood. Where is Count Raspinoff? Are the firemen ready, Petrov? Ready? Go ahead. Get it over with. Tell them to stop. Hey! I'll lead you to Raspinoff. But if I do, will you promise to let the eagle go free? Petrov, don't fire. As you were. You have my word for it. Petrov. The girl will lead you to Count Raspinoff. When he's safely in your hand, hand to the eagle. told me you searched this place. You better not try to fool me. I won't. When I'm sure the eagle will be freed, I'll show you where Raspinoff is hidden. Lock him in the sexton's room and give me the key. All right. Provided there isn't any way for him to escape. Safe enough. Put him in here. Now show us where Count Raspinoff is hidden.
troop ship anchored off Monterey, and it's ready to land men and take over California as soon as Burr makes a payment in gold. What'll we do? Grab Burr's gold mine. That's a good idea. All right, boys, if the fire's out, let's mount up. She's out. Good, let's go. Do you really think the American soldiers will get here in time to keep California from becoming a Russian colony? Sure. Salvation went out to fetch them. I've never known that old alligator to fail at anything. Yes, of course you'll find Fremont. Where is the treaty? I presume your bandit sent the eagle that sent it to Captain Fremont. Fremont? And his ten soldiers? They'll be taken care of just as soon as they enter or take a pass. It's the only entrance into the valley from the north. And I've planted four tons of blasting powder. That ought to give them a noisy reception. You mean the passage mine? Just as soon as you land your troops, your czar will become the owner of one of the wealthiest colonies in the world. Gold, tons of it. Just waiting to be turned into cash. Yes, waiting, that's the point. Uh, I refuse to land any troops until you made full payment. According to our agreement. Well, you want me to pay for goods before they're delivered. Well, I'm rich. I can afford to trust anyone. It's gold you want. Listen to this. Better off. Right to the mines. Have all available bullion loaded. Leave orders to have a uh, hundred weight set aside for my friend Count Rathenau. You heard my orders. Now go. Yes, sir. How long before those gold bars will be cold enough to ship? Maybe two. I can't wait that long. Cool them off. I haven't any way of doing it. You haven't, eh? Well, then sit on them.
the vigilante horses. That means they've beaten us to the mine. We'll have to fight. Prepare for a siege. Come and I. You'll be all right now, Doris. Your father will take you to the mission just as soon as Fremont gets here. Fremont? Yes, he's coming with American troops to drive Burr out of California. He should be pretty close to Ortega Pass. He can't come that way. The pass is mine. Burr has been planting powder there for weeks. The Cossacks will blow it up on them. I must get to Fremont and warn him. <laughs> offering to deliver California in exchange for the office of governor. We know that. That's why I bring you this. And what we want to know is, hey, you are coming. Yes. American troops? Not yet. Hurry up and get the rest of that powder planted. Right. we 
Fremont's coming. We're ready to move out. We're going to blow up this place. <laughs> All right now, Doris. Your father will take you to the mission just as soon as Fremont gets here. Fremont? Fremont? Yes, he's coming with American troops to drive Burr out of California. He should be pretty close to Ortega Pass. Can't come that way. The pass is mine. Burr has been planting powder there for weeks. The Cossacks will blow it up on them. I must get to Fremont and warn him. Any sign of those American troops? Not yet. Hurry up and get the rest of that powder planted. Right.
Fremont's coming. They're ready to move out. We're going to blow up this place. <laughs> Take a pass. No one will ever get through there again. We'll have to go around the mountain and enter Santa Rosalie from the east. But that'll take days. Vigilantes can only hold Burr's gold mine for another hour or two. I know where there's a goat trail that sort of corkscrews up a cliff and then wiggles down into the valley. Well, where is it? Can we get through? Well, I don't know how it is going up, but I come down by the way. We'll try it. Wait! Wait! Close call. I hope we get to the mine in time. We'd best be going. Right. There's a sniper at work somewhere. Those shots are not coming from the mine.
gunfire. It's impossible to mistake it. Where's artillery? Forward! Fight! Right, Doris. Then take your father to the mission. I hope Fremont catches the Cossacks before they reach the floor. sure about the gold payment after all. You're not worrying, are you, Bert? No. He's 
South Asian. Hey, John, you're aiming to blow him up. Maybe wet chalk could chalk it over the wall. That ain't a good idea. on my saddle. Wait a minute, Don. What are you getting ready to do? Open those gates for you. I'm going to make a dash for it. You drop that by the wall. You're mad. You'll never make it. I won't permit you to take the risk. You want those gates blown open, don't you? Now, there won't be any risk if you let me do it my way. I'm going to ride out through that thicket and out to the wall and tear along it. And all you've got to do is to keep up a hot fire. on the vigilantes. Well, I won't need this anymore. Russia's retiring from California. Don't mind. I shall take this with me. Governor, too. Congratulations, my son. You'll make a great governor. 